morning. I'm Angus Croc. You all know me as the famous Scottish blues singer. <laughs> my glasses are right there. And my ukes down there. I sell more albums in Scotland than Elvis Presley or the Beatles. But I'm not here to plug myself. I'm here to do a show. So, welcome to Conversational Scottish. All right. First of all, a wee word about mail. Now, look. I'm gratified with your response to my show, but please stop writing. I just burn it anyway. I don't have time to read it. I do this show for free, you know. Remember, it's PBS. That stands for please break your back for nothing. All right, let's start wasting time and get onto some new phrases. Then we'll all get out of here sooner. Okay, here's an old purpose phrase. Bob's your uncle. Say that over to yourself. Bob's your uncle. Ah, that's good. Use that at the end of any wee bit of conversation you don't understand. Or when silence crops up in conversation, like if you weren't listening or something, eh? Bob's your uncle. I bet you're saying that at home right now, eh? Bob's your uncle. Well, listen to me. I'm not here for my health. All right. Say that phrase. Bob's your uncle. Okay. Now, here's a money-saving phrase for you. Can I owe it to you? Can I owe it to you? The full phrase is, can I owe it to you? All I got's a fiver. All I got's a fiver. Say that over to yourself. That's a five-guinea note, which is hard to get change for, even in Scotland. Use this phrase when you're out and you're in a pension you might have to shell out, you know? In bars or restaurants, wherever you want to keep the money right close to home. Okay, now we'll move on here. Hey, what? Wait a minute. Where's my blackboard eraser? Who took it? Come on! The cameramen here are wise guys. You got it, don't you, eh? Well, you give it to me or I'll crack your lens with my stick. You hear me? You cheeky wee monkey. do this show for free, you know. I don't have to put up with that. You get paid. I see you back there making wee faces. Well, two can play that game. <laughs> All right. Here's another phrase. Away with you. Away with you. That's kind of a put down, but it has the added value of also meaning push off or get off my back. <laughs> away with you. And to you, the cameraman, away with you, eh? <laughs> All right. Here's another favorite of mine, wee beasties. Wee beasties. That's a summertime phrase. It's good for when the bugs come out in the summer. Close the door or the wee beasties will get in. Close the door or the wee beasties will get in. Have you got that? Good. And finally, that's my marmalade. That's my marmalade. Say that again. That's my marmalade. This phrase will keep you from getting ripped off, like I was when I agreed to do this show. All right, away with you. The show's over. Tomorrow we'll do soccer match put-downs like, you bandy-legged wee monkey, put that ball down! Good day.